Hi everyone, I'm the pastor with South Community Church and welcome to the Spirit Minute today. Can we be pulled in so many different directions? I mean, we get our lives get cut like pieces of pie, like pieces of, 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 of a portion of a pie, I guess, that goes to different things. Our families, our jobs, our hobbies, our, our, uh, some of our wants, our needs, our desires, whatever it is, it can be cut in so many different portions. Well, we give those out and man, we become so empty, don't we? Well, David, the king, you remember this, he is writing in Psalms. He's talking about just the word of God and what it means to him. Well, he was a guy that was cut in so many different ways. He was a king. So many people were pulling on him. So he was, you know, no different than we are today when we're dealing with so many different areas of our life. Well, listen to what he says in Psalm 119, 57. When everything became so chaotic, I believe this was... King David saying to his God, you are my portion, O Lord, and I have promised to obey your words. Now we all know the story of David that there were times in his reign when he had begun, he had gone astray, but he came back to God. He was a man after God's own heart. And when things got too crazy in his life, he knew he could come back to that phrasing. For God, you are my portion. Even though I am cut in so many different ways and given out in so many directions, I know, God, that I can come back to you and you are my portion, God, for I have promised to obey your words. How has that worked for you today? If you have any chaos and struggle and instability going on in your lives, maybe it's time to just stop and say to God, God, you are my portion today. I want to obey you. And I believe it definitely will be a blessing to you. Well, listen, have a great day and we'll see you on Friday.